Hello and welcome to another edition of the Northliner podcast. I'm your host, Sean Lynch, founder and executive director of the Northliner Foundation. The Northliner Foundation is committed to preserving the legacy and heritage of Herman the Duck, the beloved mascot of North Central Airlines and Republic Airlines. Our mission is to inspire the next generation of commercial pilots, aviators, and aviation professionals through our scholarship initiative, aviation education, and ultimately operating our own aircraft to small communities and air shows across the Midwest and North America. This is our five-minute podcast. However, today is a bit different. We're actually doing a double edition. Today is the 1st of August, 2016, and Air Venture Oshkosh 2016 just concluded yesterday. I really wish I could have attended, but I was unable to because of work conflicts. Thanks to the Experimental Aircraft Association who hosts Air Venture 2016, they've done a phenomenal job in um, expanding their media outlets. So if you can't attend, there are numerous ways that you can partake in Air Venture, one of which is through their EAA radio. Throughout the week of Air Venture, they're broadcasting live from the event. Also, there were many live streams from the event as well, so you could actually see the action and what was happening on the grounds from many different webcam locations. And then through Twitter, there have been thousands of posts of participants from AirVenture, not to mention Facebook and other social media outlets as well. One thing that always happens to me after AirVenture is I get really hyper-inspired about aviation. And for the Northliner Foundation, uh, it was a very active week for posting as well. In fact, during the week, we actually launched a Twitter feed uh, because I was inspired by what was happening at AirVenture at hashtag OSH16 just to see the content and everything, just really cool stuff popping up on there. Twitter is something that I had been thinking about doing, but I didn't think that it was really something that was relevant or would fit into the Northlander Foundation. But after seeing how it was used for Air Venture, it was apparent that it would be a great outlet for the Northlander Foundation. Some other outlets that we are using, one is YouTube. We have a YouTube channel. From YouTube, look for the Northlander Foundation. Obviously, we're on Facebook, the Northlander Foundation. And I'll have links to all our outlets in the show notes. Something else I'm very fired up about is the Aviation Heritage Center of Wisconsin. It's in Sheboygan Falls, Wisconsin. It's an aviation museum. They are undergoing a new exhibit they're taking on to commemorate North Central Airlines. Over the course of the past year, they've been on the hunt for a DC-3 to ferry to Sheboygan Falls to have on display as a static display for the museum and the airplane would be painted in North Central Airlines colors. It would be the cornerstone of the exhibit. Just a few weeks ago they were able to locate and secure a DC-3 airplane. The airplane's in storage out in Southern California. John Helmiak is the executive director of the Aviation Heritage Center of Wisconsin And since the Aviation Heritage Center of Wisconsin and the Northliner Foundation have a similar theme, we've been collaborating over the course of the past two years. The museum's goal is to have the airplane back to Wisconsin by May of next year. However, the biggest obstacle right now is still raising $75,000 to fund flight costs and do some aircraft maintenance that the airplane needs because it has been in storage for many, many years. Before we're out of time, I want to open up a forum for you, our listeners, to sound off on if you have an idea of an effective way to do some heavy fundraising or ideas for sponsorship. One last point, the airplane, because it's in favorable condition, the intent now is to restore it and then put it on flying tours to tour the Midwest where North Central Airlines flew the airplane, meaning quite possibly we could see a DC-3 in North Central Colors at Oshkosh in coming years, and that is stupendous. A heartfelt congratulations to the Aviation Heritage Center of Wisconsin for what you've done. I know there are so many Herman the Duck fans out there that just can't believe that this is actually happening. We are over the numbers for the Northlander Foundation. I'm Sean Lynch. We'll be right back.